Okay, welcome back to Condemned 2. Uh... So, yeah, let's do this, uh, crime scene. Steving image. Nice work. Looks gruesome. Are we sure it's even blood and not red paint? Get a sample so we can determine one way or another. While you're at it, collect a sample of those weird-looking metal pieces. Receiving sample data from your field kit now. Let's see. Blood type is AB negative, which is the same as Rachel Mars. Less than 1% of adults have this type, so I would say we have a match. All right, now let's take a look at those metal pieces. Evidence sample consists of thin metal strips and small bolt-shaped pins. Alloy properties similar to Damascus steel but does not match known foundry formulas. Blood, human tissue, and bone fragments are present on all surfaces of sample. Any evidence the metal pieces came from Rachel Mars' body? Yes. The coroner has found extensive scar tissue throughout her body and bored holes in her bones, matching the dimensions of the metal pieces you discovered. I'd say Rachel Mars had a secret, and it may have gotten her killed. What? Some sort of fucked up masochistic lifestyle? Whatever it was, it looked painful. The pathology report will tell us if she was abusing painkillers. Ethan, the cops are on their way. We finally managed to get a warrant to search the rest of the museum. Get to the main lobby if you can. I still have to photograph the last statue. <laughs> Heard that coming. I thought I would be able to, like, God, there are so many missed opportunities for environmental kills here. Oh, I mean, not that. That. Well, at least the guard died. Now I don't have to... Fuck. Ow. Ow. Fuck! At least there's a checkpoint there. I'm gonna be super pissed off if the last one is actually in there and I've wasted all this time going back through everything. Is that one? No, that's just a suit.
<sighs> well, that seriously limits where I can go. Now I have to find something to hit with. What was that? Whatever. <coughs> oh. oh, man. Tell me I haven't gotten this one yet. Oh, god damn it, why do I keep doing that? Come on, please, please, please. Okay, so there's the indoors one. It is so goddamn easy to get lost. There's that outside one. But where's the other one? Is that it? Or is that the same one that I was just... That's the same one I was just at. Shit. That is really impressive. You can actually read this stuff. Can't I climb this? Guess not. One second. <clears throat> well, this is frustrating. Guess the only place to go is into that one area that I haven't been to yet. This is annoying. Let me just test something. So that one's right there. Does the thing change? Yeah, it does. Fuck it. 
I'm just gonna go in this way and hope for the best. And as of now, I cannot get back. I remember this guy. This guy is... Shit. Oh. Fuck. I don't even know if that's doing anything. No! This is not what I need. Oh! Mother! That scared me. What the fuck are you hitting me with? Oh, a short sword. That's it. God. That's it. Quickly, before someone gets me from behind. Why isn't this working? Pictures do I need to take? This wasn't that far back, and if it was before, just before the night, all I have to do is just run. Yeah, all I have to do is run. What happens if I tase him? Nothing. Okay.
Ow. I thought, uh, yeah, the, there was just a glitch. There we go. I have perfected the mission. Sentry's crossbow. <coughs> now, this is where it kind of starts to get a bit ridiculous. These things have special sonic arrows. I don't know how that works, but... Oro means voice in Latin, so I guess it kind of makes sense. But the this sonic crossbow is the only way to kill the knight. I could really use a drink. Maybe not. Can be reloaded? I didn't know that. Okay, well. Oh, Jesus, that's not what I meant to do. Looking more beat up every time I see you. I think you overstayed my welcome. I found something when investigating Van Horn's body. Metal pieces? No, 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 something better. I found traces of fecal matter on his shoes. 
I'm so? gonna finish. It belongs to an endangered deer species found only in the Black Lake region. You mean the wildlife preserve up north? Yeah, I figure the best way to track SKX is to start with Van Horn and work our way back. Seems like a long shot if you ask me. Two hour flight tops. I'll make the arrangements for a plane to take you there. <sighs> All right, I could use some sleep. Good. Dorland here has volunteered to take you. What do you hope to find up there? <laughs> the target just boarded the plane. Gold, yay. Drop up to three waypoints. Great. I really don't care. Ethan, your chest x-ray shows you do have vocal cords similar to Van Horn's. But even more bizarre. I'm related to Van Horn, is that what you're saying? The thought crossed my mind. However, I was able to confirm that you do not share blood with that family. That's comforting. But you still think I'm connected somehow? Yes, I do. It just seems kind of crazy, that's all. When you land, search the lodge thoroughly and learn as much as you can. It's been abandoned for decades, but I have a hunch both Van Horns were there recently. <sighs> How much time we got left? Hey, buddy, did you hear me? Hello, Ethan. We don't have much time, so I'll get right to the point. Your old boss, Pharaoh, is trying to protect you. Have you taken a moment to contemplate the meaning of this? He's the one that hired you. He guided you through the ranks at SCU and has kept a close watch on your career. Perhaps he's done this under false pretenses. He may have ulterior motives, using you. Something to think about when choosing your friends. So what happened to the pilot? Oh! Oh shit! Mayday! Mayday! This is Flight 324, come in! Hit in the face with him. Do you really expect to find anything out here other than a cold death? That's helpful. Outdoor environments, though, are rarity for a condemned game. Mr. Thomas, Ethan, this is Deputy Director Farrell. Going there alone was not a good idea. It's time you level with me. No bullshit. Yes, yes, you have every right to question me. Look, there are... some of us who see you as the threat. The enemy. And where do you stand? I see you as an asset. A special tool too great to be wasted. Remendium. Remendium? I, I don't understand. 
Hello? Ah, so no emitters, that helps. Ah, so I can't go that way anyway. Come in. You made it. How was your flight? Slept like a baby. Good. What do you have? That. Yeah. Receiving evidence. A human arm? Ew. See if you can determine how fresh it is. Uh, February... One second. It was turning to the 24th, it looks like. One second. Twelve. Okay. That's not right. This is probably wrong. February 24th is today. You better get a sample and send me the data. What? Receiving data. Okay, give me a moment. The skin tissue and blood type are definitely human in origin. I'm also detecting concentrations of mineral salts, urea, and amino acids in the sample. It looks like saliva. I need more time to analyze this properly. Keep looking for the lodge. I'll call you back in a few. Well, that's not good. What do I need this spectrometer for? There are no emitters, so... Okay, this is unexpected. Your spectrometer is picking up concentrations of formaldehyde. This should be interesting. FYI, I'm still working on that saliva sample. Arginine vasopressin in the saliva. Very unusual. Arginine vasopressin is an amino acid that naturally occurs in mammals and is typically triggered by dehydration.
Dehydration? With all this snow? Dehydration can also be caused by disease. Kidney failure, dysentery, hydrophobia. By the way, Ethan, hydrophobia is the later stages of rabies. So watch yourself. Uh-oh. And how is there formaldehyde in the air? Okay, that is it for now. I hope you guys are enjoying Condemned 2 so far, and hope to see you guys next time.